once the CAC realizes that teachers are serious about what we're requesting, I think they'll move. I think they have to. Parents of Quebec students and teachers, part of striking public sector unions, flooded the streets in front of Premier Legault's downtown Montreal office Friday as there's been some movement at the negotiating table. We've been out in the streets 22 days. Students deserve to be back in school, and families are showing us today. It was organized really by families and citizens, this uh, big rassemblement, and so they're showing us that they want to be back in school. While hundreds were on the street, the FSC, the largest teachers' union in the province affiliated with the CSQ, part of the Common Front, presented a draft proposal on working conditions to its union after an overnight negotiating blitz with the Quebec government. I hope it means that the government is actually moving on those core, core issues like class composition and support for students. I hope that's what the signal is, and I hope that they'll be offering us the same thing soon. It's one of the first good signs we've had in a while, so yeah, hopefully uh, the, there's a domino effect for uh, for the other unions as well. Rosemarie Perrault's son Henri has been out of school since November 23rd when the 66,000 member FAE teachers union went on strike. She herself works in healthcare and is part of the common front. I really want a good public education for my son. I believe in the public system so I'm here to show my support and maybe put a little pressure on the government. I want to cry. I mean it's so nice. All of the people here with us you know all the parents are just everyone are telling me you know we're really tired but go don't like don't give up striking FAE teachers have been without pay for almost a month I knew since April that we were going on strikes so I've been very careful with my money for that purpose uh, willing to get out of, out of my pajamas and go to work it's getting more difficult uh, I, I do these uh, these protests I do the marches but to get back into the classroom is going to be like going back in August it's like back Back to school after the summer off. That would be really nice to spend my holidays knowing that I'm going to come back in January seeing my students. That would be the biggest gift. In Montreal, Alicia Rubertucci, City News.